All right, so today's mission is I'm gonna see if I can get a rainbow trout on the fly. There's lots of fish moving around me. Um, yeah, we're on Sky. And this is uh, one of the Portree Angling Association's locks. Anyhow, I'm, I'm here to catch something to eat. Um, you know, obviously rainbow trout aren't, aren't native, but they're still good fun to catch, I think. Not caught one before, so we'll see. Um, we're gonna have a little camp out tonight. Hopefully cook a fish over over the coals. And yeah, exciting. Let's get to it. I'm fishing dry flies today. Yeah, daddy long legs. Let's see how we come along. I'm uh, pretty hopeful. There's a lot of moving. A couple of other guys fishing down there and I don't really want to fish on top of them so I've moved moved down a little and yeah, we'll, we'll see how we go I'm gonna change this up so that I'm fishing two dry flies there's so much on the top and I think that's the way to go today because um, I've got one wet at the moment well, uh, maybe I should just continue with one wet I'll fish it a little bit longer and then then we'll make a decision. You can always change. But yeah, I was busy setting up when those guys came. Came and nabbed my spot. <laughs> okay. It's a big enough place. without frightening anybody. That's a good fish. Adrenaline spike, my friend. Fish on. Just trying to keep it high. Oh, he's still got some life in him. Oh, God. Okay, I'm onto my leader isn't a good a good thing. Let's see if I can start bringing him back. 
This is the biggest fish I've ever caught on the fly. By a long way. By a long way. See if we can land this. Oh man, that's exciting. yet and this is a rainbow trout so I'm gonna be keeping it okay come on it's time is it time it's time it's time it's time my boy come on my boy <laughs> look at that <laughs> now that now that is a proper fish <laughs> well tonight and I'm gonna eat well tomorrow <laughs> and the next day <laughs> I was gonna get a, a lobster and a crab tonight but I don't think I'm going to that's a big enough fish uh, man that was cool uh, biggest fish I've caught on the fly ever first first rainbow trout as well that I've ever got so that's pretty cool oh, I still got the camera on my head look at that fish look at that fish Absolutely beautiful. Actually, um, <laughs> went to the barber this morning to get a haircut, and he, <laughs> I wasn't planning on fishing today. And he said, "You know, he comes up here, and he got seven rainbows between three and five pounds in 45 minutes." <laughs> oh, okay, <laughs> that's that's a lot of fish. <laughs> I'm not sure I could bring them in that fast, but. It uh, got me to come out here and do a bit of fishing and I'm really glad that it did because that was amazing as a first experience and the biggest fish I've ever caught on, on the fly. Yeah, couldn't, couldn't be happier man, couldn't be happier. Really cool. Anyway, I'm going to take this jacket off because I'm starting to sweat. And I've, I've not committed to this fly because it's, it's a little more tricky to fish. I guess in a way, I like that. Anyhow, let's get this camera on my head. Let's see if we can nab another one of those beauties. I'm wearing the buff just because um, the sun, I know it doesn't look sunny, but I burn ridiculously easily. And too often, because I'm out here all the bloody time. So, here we go, looking nice and ridiculous. Let's go see if we can catch another fish. Did I just put this on? I did, yes. Uh, let's see if we can go get another fish. Just can't get it there. They're just out of, out of my reach. Don't know if you can see that mayfly. Pretty cool.
one right here. I think he's smaller. That's okay. I wouldn't mind catching something a little smaller. Let's see if we can entice him. I'm just gonna strip this back pretty quick. Jesus, just fish everywhere. There we go. That's the one. If I can cast him. This is so cool. Oh my god. There it is. There it is. <laughs> oh, there he goes. There he goes. Oh, shit. Oh, god. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Bring this onto the reel. That was a cool little display, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, there he goes. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> oh, what do I do? There we go. <laughs> There he goes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I could do this all day. I wish I hadn't kept that one. I just got a little ahead of myself. I should have kept one a little smaller like this. This guy's got more fight in him though. I don't want to tire it up too much, so let's bring him in. Well, he's still going. Yeah, it's going to take me a while to recover this fish, I reckon. Still got a little, little bit of go in him. I wish I had a landing net, must say. Corner of the mouth. Oh, damn it, man. There we go. All right, I did. Oh, there he goes. That was cool. That was really cool. Fish on! There she goes. <laughs> oh, there she goes.
Oh. Oh shit. <laughs> Oh no, that camera's dead. Come on, you don't want to go in there. Drag it on the ground. Very nicely hooked in the corner of the mouth. Once again. Oh. I don't mind a picture of this. Look at that. <laughs> On. Oh, she's a fighter. She's a fighter. What a day. Nope, come this way, come this way. Come this way. Oh, it's right on me. Oh, shit, biggest one of the day, I reckon. <laughs> Pretty treacherous. I thought uh, a barber was talking shit this morning about how many fish he was catching, but turns out he, he was not. Yeah, there we go. Man, I could do this all day, I tell you. Again, just trying to bring his fish in quite fast. I don't want to tie him up too much. What a day, <laughs> what a day. <laughs> Alright, come here. Give me a lassie. Ooh, this guy's a little bit scarred up. It's actually not that big. Don't break me off, don't break me off, don't break me off. Don't break me off. It's not giving up. It's not giving up. Come here. Come here, come here, come here. Come here. Come here. Jeez. It's 
fish is not ready. <laughs> on it. Yeah, okay, be me. Just a fish. Oh. <laughs> He's really been scarred up. That must have been a big fish that hit it. Shame. Anyway, it's a fighter, that's for sure. Get him back in straight away. Because it's it's not tired. I kind of roped him in. Whenever you're ready, pal. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna struggle to say I'm done, Tazzy. I'm, I'm, I'm finding this hard. <laughs> yeah, but it, it's about the day. There's a, a mayfly hatch. You can see all of them landing on the water, and that's where all the fish are rising. Oh. You want to go? Yeah, okay. <laughs> so, I think we're done there. Do we need one more? Yeah. Okay, one more. <laughs> Tazzy says one more. <laughs> That's the last one. Last one. My god, it's so fun. <laughs> oh, so much for me, only. Yeah. <laughs> okay, one more fish, one more fish. On. There we go. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh. and away she goes. <laughs> Last fish of the day. towards me. There she goes. Oh. <laughs> Brutal. <laughs> Does that count? No. Unfortunately, the camera died on my head a while ago and the other camera died a while ago too, so just using Taz's phone, but that's the last fish of the day. Absolutely pristine, really good condition. Yeah. Right, let's get him. Let's get him on hooks and get him on his way. Again, perfectly in the corner of the mouth. And that's the little uh, lids I've been getting it on all day. <laughs> it's just a little like butterfly imitation, little yellow butterfly. Yeah, let's get this fish gone. I really would have liked to have kept a fish this size compared to that other. 
that other fish is probably a bit big to me, but we'll eat it. Yeah. Look at those fish. Hi. Man, what a good day. What a good day. Right, we're gonna go make the camp. We'll see you down there on the beach. Taz and I have, have come to our camp. There is a, a wonderful site just on that side of the fence, but fortunately there's a sign up saying no camping. Which don't understand, but it does seem like it, you know, people have camped here and they've they've built a fire pit and burnt bottles and just been Anyway, we've got a nice camp that's just on the other side of the fence. And we've got a pretty decent view. And yeah, there, there is an old fire pit that's been used before, so we won't have to create a new fire or anything. Cool, we've got our wood pile sorted and our camp all squared away. So now we're just gonna relax and enjoy the view, have a well-earned beer, and then we'll get the fire going and get cooking. Pretty, pretty nice spot. They're nice and cold. I thought they weren't that cold. I put the ice in, but they are actually pretty cold. Yeah. I don't think she gives a shit. So that I can melt and give her more water. That's a bit of just melting into my drink. What do you reckon the time is? Eight? No, uh, seven. Seven thirty. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is that your last guess? I reckon seven, yeah. Seven. Seven twenty-four. Yeah. <laughs> seven eight. Where you are. <laughs> so as we've been uh, sitting here enjoying this beer been thinking of ways I'm going to cook that trout tonight. I know it's got roe. Um, there's some roe popping up as I dispatch the fella. Anyway, so uh, to the point. So not a fella? <laughs> the ma'am, when I dispatched the ma'am. But yeah, I'm going to figure out a way of smoking it or hot, semi hot smoking it. So I need to see if I can find some wood that isn't pine probably a reach because there isn't a whole lot in the way of trees <laughs> as part of the highlands except for these pine <laughs> um, anyhow yeah we'll, we'll see what I can find I found that in the past if I smoke meat using pine it gets quite bitter uh, so we'll see if I can find anything else and we'll just do the coal bed with pine and then throw on some shavings of whatever I can find. Oh, I also forgot to say, I'm gonna try some of the roe raw, just because. I, I, I don't think it's gonna be very good, but I'm gonna try it, just because. If I don't, I won't know. I'm also gonna eat some of the trout sashimi, because I've got uh, wasabi here. Don't have any soy sauce, but got wasabi, so. <laughs> so the plan for today changed abruptly after I went for a haircut. <laughs> because the barber talked me into going fishing. Didn't, didn't take a lot, as Taz said, but I'm really glad that he did. I was gonna buy a lo lobster and a couple of crabs. Huh? You were dreaming of fishing on the way to get your hair cut, so. I was dreaming of fishing on the way. I was thinking, oh, perfect day, beautiful day. So it literally didn't take any persuading. It was <laughs> like, hey, fishing. You're like, yep, <laughs> yep, I'm gonna do that. Yup, <laughs> basically. <laughs> <laughs> we went for a little walk. And I found some driftwood, but it, you know, it's pretty shitty driftwood. In this little forest, I can see oak, and I can see uh, a couple of nuts. I see beech. Yeah, there's a fair, fair number of different woods in there, so... Species. Anyway, see if we can find a, a dead piece, um, or newly dead piece, to turn into smoking material. I've got a couple of sticks. I mean, that's fine. I'll just take the bark off of them 
and then kind of slice them down with my knife. Do a bit more effort than, than cutting up a, a log, but that's fine. It's a strange rock, isn't it? I've seen a lot of these, like, you know, they, they look pretty unnatural, that kind of rock around on this beach. I'm not sure what, what might have caused them. Some of them are a proper right angle and it looks like it's been chiseled, but I'm not sure what somebody would use that for. It's nice to have a fire pit that we don't have to make. You know, I always feel a little bit guilty making a fire pit where there isn't one already. Especially in a place like Scotland where you know, you know that somebody else is going to come across it. It's not, not like you're out in the middle of nowhere in South Africa where you know people take a long, long time to cut across each other's paths. Anyway, um, I don't know what that is, somebody's old wet wipe. <laughs> Appetizing fire creation pieces here. Bought this last weekend when we had a couple of friends around just to eat. Bought, bought the, the reusable, I mean the, the instant barbecue just, just for the grate so we couldn't find a bridegroom. The barbecue grid, so now we've got a, a, a couple of coals. That's what I'm up out of this. And what I'm going to do is take these coals and just ditch them up. You see, this has already got some nice little holes in it to allow smoke out. So I'm going to just go wash that out in the ocean and then flip it over. So our fish is going to sit on the grill over there with the row. That's going to sit over the top. And then that is going to sit over my little instant, uh, not my little instant, my little camping barbecue tray, which is that. And that's all just going to be glorious, isn't it? That's pretty cool. <laughs> Look at our newest gimmick. <laughs> the coolest little braai. <laughs> Swiss South African army knife. <laughs> Dry master mess. <laughs> okay. the first egg that's just popped up. See that? You can see there's like a little red um, point on it and that's the that membrane-ish like embryo starting. Um, and yeah let's, let's see if I can open this up and then we can see properly. I must say I don't feel great about taking a fish that's got eggs like this. It's not the first time this has happened. Um, and I didn't know when I caught this fish uh, I handled it really badly when I was actually getting out of the water because I didn't want to lose the fish and I put my hands into its gills and tore it around a bit as it was moving out so yeah that happened and then I saw it spurt some eggs out so yeah I knew I was gonna be killing this fish but yeah let's 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 um, See if, yeah, you see, look at that. Look at the amount of eggs in there. It's a lot of eggs. Anyhow, let's eat some. I'm actually not sure. Uh, do, those, do those little dots mean that it's fertilized? I don't know. I can't put them back, it's dead now, baby. Anyway, I don't know, if you want to rinse them, I might not bother. Like. Maybe just a wee little rinse. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Let's let's give these a try. So. Don't lean on them. Don't lean on them. 
that's um is that focusing? Yes. Focusing? Alright, let's give them a go. They they smell just like fish. Hmm. Kind of like bubble tea. Like a fishy bubble tea. <laughs> Not bad though. Not caviar that you'll get in a restaurant, but it's really not bad. Do you want to try some? But caviar is like processed. No, no. She's not sure about that. She's not sure. You like it? Yeah. It's it's really not bad though. I mean, uh, actually less flavoursome than I expected. Like a slight bit of fishiness, fishiness, slight bit of fishiness, but not not majorly so. The only thing is that it, it's not held together with like an egg sac, so I'm not sure how I'm going to keep them on the barbecue in order to smoke them. But they're, they're not bad. I had, um, I tried deep fried wild brown trout roe, and this is nicer than that, and this is raw, so that just goes to show something. But anyhow, I'm gonna finish cleaning this up. I think we might like it. <laughs> She's looking for more. I don't know, you didn't see her tongue up. Uh, they do have like an egg sack, okay. So, there's like. <laughs> no, that's enough. There, there's the row in, in the actual sack. And there's two of those. <laughs> Should I give her one? Not, no, not a whole one. She'll, she'll diarrhea everywhere. <laughs> she'll diarrhea everywhere. She'll shit herself. She'll make herself bomb. I'll give her some. You like it? Yeah? Cool. Come on, eat it if you're gonna eat it. <laughs> <laughs> not liking that. <laughs> that was pretty funny. <laughs> she still likes it. She likes it, she's just not sure how to eat it. Anyhow, very hygienic, dog's licking out of my hand. Lucky dog. <laughs> anyway, okay. Back, 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 back. Good dog. Good dog. Back. back. finish cleaning this fish up. So that's like the sum of the eggs that I've managed to salvage. There are a few kind of waste. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but like I, I reckon that's a good 80% besides what I ate and BMO ate. So it's not, not too bad. Look at the, the gut material on that. Like I, I'm not sure if that's healthy. Whatever this is, seems weird to me. I'm not sure what the f that is. Excuse my language. Doesn't look healthy. That's not like I. I don't recognise that from a fish's stomach, and I've I've gutted quite a few fish in the last 20 years. Um, yeah, I can't can't figure out what that is. What is it? I'm not sure. Look at it. Like it, it's. It, it's not worms, but it's like a, a hard organ. Like a tumour. Yeah, like a tumour. That's gross. You could just take a picture of it, I mean. It's probably regular. I mean, I've, I've, I've never taken a part of rainbow trout. Anyway. None of that's getting eaten. That's going into the ocean. Uh, it is getting eaten, just not by me. Yeah, not by me. Okay. Well, that was fairly uh, 
butcherish, but it's still a very decent chunk of meat off of that fish. I've still got the pin bones in there. I might just pull them out one by one, but not 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 uh, by any means upset with that, considering blunt knife and a stone to work on. <laughs> All these excuses. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm gonna just lay this down on something. Um, or I'll just move the fish and I'm gonna cut a piece of this and eat it right now instead while well, there's still a bit of light. <coughs> I mean, that's not too bad. It's, it's fairly clean. I mean, I did miss a bit of meat, but you know, like I said, I'll either make a soup out of that or something tomorrow. Make a stock, a nice fish stock. <laughs> Taz is not excited for that. Anyhow, I'm gonna put this, this piece away for, for the next day. And that's what we're gonna eat tonight. That's, that's the chunk that I'm gonna eat of sashimi. And uh, Bimo is listfully looking forward to this. It's, it, it's strange, I mean, I'm, I'm not massively impressed with the quality of this fish. It's, it's good, it looks nice, but it's, it's not like, it's not like a wild fish. It doesn't look like a, a brown trout's, you know, nice vibrant color or just, I don't know, something about it that just doesn't make me think like, ooh, this is gonna be nice sashimi. But anyway, let's, let's, let's have a go and um, see how it is. So I'm gonna start with just a nice little thin strip like that with a bit of wasabi on top. It would be nice if I had a plate, but uh, I don't. So just a tiny little squeeze of wasabi. So that's our sashimi. Look, Bima thinks I'm giving it to her. It's really good. No, oh, thank you. It's actually really good. That's that's delicious. I by no means can complain about that. Mm. It's really good. It's really really good. Don't even need the wasabi. I thought so. <laughs> okay, I'm actually gonna eat all of that because <laughs> it's really good. <laughs> I mean, I'm I'm pleasantly surprised. I I I don't know what I expected, but I thought it was gonna be some other flavor, not delicious trout. But it is um, very much delicious trout, which is good. That makes me happy. So I'm gonna, yeah, eat, eat this all. Sashimi! And then the rest will be done. Semi-smoked, semi-bried. You know the vibe. Okay, so we've got a, a, a beautiful splayed fish head and the spice that we've got on here is chili and, and onion, which we'll see how that goes. I reckon it'll probably be pretty good. And we've got all of our fish eggs there and they're just gonna smoke with that on top. So the idea is this just... gets a little bit spread out don't want it too hot because I want this to like get fairly smoky so that now sits there just like that and this goes over the top you know what those are what it's the egg? eggs that are falling through that's crazy who would have thought they'd be so explosive <laughs> Popping like little popcorns. <laughs> Makes me think of District 9. <laughs> Did you restore something out of that packet? Yeah. That wasn't like an egg exploding on No, no it was not an egg exploding. Fire packets. <laughs> Here we go. This is going to be interesting. Interesting is the word I'll we'll use. I'm, I'm looking forward to that. I'm not so much looking forward to the... Um, smoked fish eggs just because I feel like they probably were at their best when they were raw. Okay so my plan is to pick this up and move it over there 
without dropping give me, give me. anything at all. And it worked flawlessly. Better than expected, actually. Right. So, this isn't quite smoked. It's more just um, cooked. But there should be some smokiness to it. Let's have a little taste. Ooh, How many that. bones in it? Man, yes, there are. There are pin bones running down that line to about there. But, you know, I can just pick those up. As I just did. One more. Is that a bone? There we go. Alright, so that's, that's what we're working with. And it is um, beautiful, beautiful looking fish. Smells really good too. Mm, tastes really good too. Buttery. Yeah. Just a bit too close. Anyway. <laughs> It's really good. It's really, really good. I'm going to enjoy <laughs> Your dinner. that very thoroughly. Okay, now to try these fish eggs. Yeah, I'd be lying if I was saying I was super excited for this. Um, I'm just going to use the spoon. They just look deflated. Yeah, deflated is a good word. Um, <clears throat> I think that the, the... They're not... They, uh, they just look the same, to be honest. Yeah. Anyhow. They smell better. They smell smoky and delicious. They're warm now. No, a lot fishier. A huge amount fishier. It's it's not bad. It's it's a good flavour. Essence of trout. It's it's nice like it's got that whole bite sensation. I think the the one thing that brings it down is the fact that there's still like the the egg skin, and I've still got like that the, the kind of egg skins in my mouth, which are chewy. Don't know what to do with that. Get swallowed them down. Okay, let's have another a much bigger bite and see if it's better with a better with quantity. You can see some of those are a lot more cooked than others and all smoky. Hmm. Flavor's good. Interesting sensation too, but like leathery leathery skin. Okay, let's have a bit of a fish cheek because there's a a decent cheek on each of these. Oh, might get a bit of an eyeball with it. Oops. <laughs> that's actually a really nice little. No, that's not for you, baby. <laughs> Perfect little cheek. That's um. Hmm. Tastes like nice trout. Soft, delicious, and beautiful. Okay, I'm just gonna. Now, tuck in because this is my dinner. And I'm done reviewing it. Now I'm just going to eat. Eat it. But yeah. Last little look. That's, uh, I mean, the star of the show is definitely the, the actual fish itself, not its eggs or its cheeks. Anyhow, we'll end the video here. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, glad. If you didn't, sorry. See you on the next one or not. Cheers. Good night. Or good morning or good day. Whatever it is. Bye.